Okay, good morning everyone. So, welcome again to our bread and pastry production grade 8. So, I am Miss Mary and Fonte, your teacher for today. Okay, so before we start to our new lesson, let's have a pretest. So, let us check if what you have already know. So, write true if the statement is correct and false if it is not. Number one. A breakdown of these devices may affect the quality of the food being prepared and cause slowdown in production and service. What do you think is the answer? Okay. Is it true or false? So the answer is true. Next, number two, negligence of cleanliness will not lead to the growth of foodborne bacteria. Negligence of cleanliness will not lead to the growth of food-borne bacteria. The answer is false because of the word will not lead to the growth of food-borne bacteria. Because negligence of cleanliness will lead to the growth of food-borne bacteria. Next, number three, grease and dirt that gather in stove, rims, and hoods are fire hazards. Grease and dirt that gather in stove, rims, and hoods are fire hazard. So this is a true. Next, number four, use of tools and equipment needs training. Use of tools and equipment needs training. So the answer is true. Of course, we need training. Number five. Expenses will be minimized if tools and equipment are not in good condition. Expenses will be minimized if tools and equipment are not in good condition. Of course, false. So expenses will be minimized if tools and equipment is in good condition. Okay, next. Number six. Store tools and equipment in a wet place. Store tools and equipment in a wet place. Is it true or false? So the answer is false. Store tools and equipment in a clean, dry place. It should be a dry, not wet place. Next, number seven. Handle fragile tools are those tools made of glass with care. Handle fragile tools or those tools made of glass with care. So this is a true. Next, number eight. Do not repair broken tools and equipment immediately. Do not repair broken tools and equipment immediately. So the answer is, of course, false because of the word do not. It should be repair broken tools and equipment immediately. Next, number nine. Report kitchen equipment that are not functioning. Report kitchen equipment that are not functioning. So the answer is true. Next, number 10. Break glasses should not be discarded. Breaks glasses should not be discarded. So the answer is false. Break glasses should be discarded. Okay, so let us proceed to the safety of tools and equipment. So the safety of tools and equipment is not only the concern of the management, but of the workers who use the equipment as well. So proper maintenance and safety of tools and equipment are important for the following reasons. So the first one is the good quality of service. So modern equipment is built in controls thermometers, and timing and regulating devices. So a breakdown of these devices may affect the quality of food being prepared and cause a slowdown in production and service. Number two is sanitation. Mechanical function of equipment like the refrigerator and freezers encourages the development of disease causing bacteria. So, the negligence of their cleanliness leads to the growth of foodborne bacteria. Next, number three, fire prevention. 
Brims and dirt decode the installed brims and hoods are fire hazards. So daily inspection of brims collecting equipment will minimize the danger of fire. Number four is the safety. Most food service accidents happens in the kitchen. So this is due to lack of knowledge and training of food worker in the use of tools and equipment. Then number five, less cost of production. Expenses will be minimized if tools and equipment are in good condition. Let us proceed to the safety measures in the use of tools and equipment. First, store knives, choppers, and cutting blades in the designated places, and then label them. Number two, repair broken tools and equipment immediately. Number three, check wiring of electrical equipment regularly report kitchen equipment that are not functioning number four handle fragile tools or those tools made of glass with care so those with breaks should be discarded and the number five store tools and equipment in a clean dry place do not keep them when wet Okay, so again, let's have an activity. So write through if the statement is correct and false if it is not. Number one, a breakdown of these devices may affect the quality of the food being prepared and cause slowdown in production and service. So the answer is true. Next, number two, negligence of cleanliness will not lead to the growth of food-borne bacteria. Negligence of cleanliness will not lead to the growth of food-borne bacteria. So the answer is false because of the word will not. So the answer is false because the statement is not correct. Number three, grease and dirt that got in stone, rims and hoods are fire hazards. Grease and dirt that gather in stove, rims and hoods are fire hazard. So the answer is two. Next, number four, use of tools and equipment needs training. Use of tools and equipment needs training. So the answer is two. Next, number five, expenses will be minimized if tools and equipment are not in good condition. So the answer is false. Next, number six, store tools and equipment in a wet place. Store tools and equipment in a wet place. So the answer is false. So the answer is store tools and equipment in a clean, dry place. Next, number seven, handle fragile tools or those tools made of glass with care. Handle fragile tools or those tools with a, made of glass with care. So the answer is two. Next, number eight, do not repair broken tools and equipment immediately. Do not repair broken tools and equipment immediately. So the answer is false. Number nine, report kitchen equipment that are not functioning. Report kitchen equipment that are not functioning. So the answer in number nine is true. Then the last one, brakes glasses should not be discarded. Brakes glasses should not be discarded. So the answer is false. Brake glasses should be discarded. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you and God bless everyone. Keep safe.